Hello everyone, today I want to share with you some recent exciting news about artificial intelligence. Let's check it out. The first one, Motion Follower. Motion Follower is a lightweight motion editing method that transfers the motion trajectory from a target video to an original video while retaining the original video's background and the main character's appearance. From the samples provided by Motion Follower, we can see that it's possible to add new dance moves to an original video. Synthesizing a new dance video that retains the original video's background and camera movements. This method can be used to edit TikTok dance videos. Compared to tools of the same level, Motion Follower can generate stable and smooth dance movements. The release of this technology will make motion editing simpler, thereby helping creators design diverse content. By the innovations of using a pair of signal controllers that extract motion-related features from the source and target videos. An AUNet-based diffusion model that uses the extracted motion features to guide the editing process and generate the final edited video. Motion Follower is trained in two stages, first on single frames, then on video clips to effectively capture the temporal dynamics. During inference, a two-branch structure is used, one for reconstruction and one for editing, with the score guidance computed using features from both branches. Currently, this project has not been officially open-sourced, but those interested can follow its progress. Next, Claude 3 update from Anthropic. This week, Anthropic announced the addition of personality training to Claude 3, enabling the AI chatbot to maintain curiosity and unique personalities. As AI technology advances, language models will also be endowed with different emotions and personalities to meet the needs of various scenarios. Ensuring safety, adding personality to robots will facilitate seamless communication with humans. Anthropic stated that as language models are applied in different countries and regions, they will face issues of value and viewpoint conflicts. With the addition of personality training, the Claude 3 model will maintain a neutral perspective and stance, enabling it to communicate with users from different countries. After training, the Claude 3 model will not hold extreme political views but will exhibit a broad and moderate personality. Currently, Anthropic is using constitutional AI techniques to train Claude 3 model. This method can be used to train a safe artificial intelligence assistant through self-improvement without requiring any human-labeled data for identifying harmful outputs. Let's talk about some AI 3D model. Auroboros 3D is an AI 3D generation framework that can create high-quality 3D models from a single input image. Have you ever wished you could turn your 2D images into fully realized 3D models? Well, the researchers at Beihang University, the Shanghai AI Laboratory, and VAST have developed a groundbreaking new AI model called Auroboros 3D that can do just that. At the heart of Ouroboros 3D is a self-conditioning mechanism that establishes a recursive association between the multi-view diffusion model and the 3D reconstruction module. During the multi-view image denoising process, the diffusion model uses the 3D aware maps rendered by the reconstruction module at the previous time step as additional conditions. This 3D-aware feedback loop unites the entire process, improving the geometric consistency of the final 3D outputs. By tightly coupling these two crucial components, Auroboros 3D is able to overcome the data bias issues that plague traditional two-stage approaches. The researchers have shown that Ouroboros 3D outperforms previous methods that separate the multi-view generation and 3D reconstruction stages, as well as those that combine them only at the inference phase. By seamlessly integrating these two critical capabilities, Ouroboros 3D is able to produce higher quality 3D models that maintain better geometric consistency. This opens up exciting new possibilities for a wide range of applications, from 3D content creation to virtual and augmented reality experiences. To learn more about this groundbreaking technology, be sure to check out the project website. Here are some AI video demonstration created by Kling AI Video Model. Kwai Show, a short video social platform, has recently opened up internal testing for its new AI video model, Kling and many users have shared their creations. We can see that the Kling models are able to transform users' imaginations into highly realistic visuals. 
whether for games, animations, or real-world scenes. The results are impressively lifelike. Furthermore, users have even used Kling to recreate the iconic opening animation from the classic 1987 TV adaptation of Journey to the West, one of CCTV's most successful literary adaptations. By combining Kling's capabilities with this beloved classic, users have faithfully reanimated this iconic sequence. Additionally, there are examples of users creating 30-second original animations using the Kling tools. Be sure to check those out as well. t 2 Viturbo. This is a brand new consistent video generation model that can generate videos from text in just four inference steps. The tool aims to address the slow iterative speed of diffusion-based models while still maintaining high video quality. Developed by researchers at UC Santa Barbara, T2V Turbo tackles a long-standing challenge in the field of video generation, the quality bottleneck of video consistency models. While video consistency models have enabled fast video generation, they have historically struggled to match the quality of iterative diffusion-based techniques. This has presented a significant limitation until now. While video consistency models have enabled fast video generation, they have historically struggled to match the quality of iterative diffusion-based techniques. This has presented a significant limitation until now. T2V Turbo breaks this quality bottleneck by incorporating feedback from a mixture of differentiable reward models, both image text and video text. This allows the model to directly optimize the rewards associated with single-step generations, bypassing the memory constraints of full iterative sampling. The results are nothing short of remarkable. T2V Turbo's four-step generations outperform even proprietary systems like Gen2 and Pika on the V-Bench benchmark. And in human evaluations, the four-step T2V Turbo samples are preferred over 50-step generations from their teacher model representing over 10x acceleration with improved quality. Experience the power of T2V Turbo yourself by trying it out on our Hugging Face demo. Already, that is it for this video. And I will see you on the next one. Have a nice day. See ya.